has Mercy Health updating its guidance to physicians when it comes to COVID testing. This information outlined in a letter that we obtained today. 5 News reporter Ian Taylor breaks down the updated guidelines. This month, it's estimated that we will hit approximately 15 million tests a day. President Joe Biden addressed the impact of the Omicron variant in our country. Hospitals and clinics are struggling to keep up with the demand for tests while keeping supplies on hand. As a result, Mercy Health has changed their guidance on when to administer a COVID test. A letter we obtained reads in part, no testing available for individuals that do not have symptoms and are requesting a test for things such as a return to work or school, travel, or exposure without symptoms. President Biden says more tests are on their way, but right now, Mercy is not sure when they will arrive. This is forcing providers to preserve their inventory. Another recommendation states that if a patient shows symptoms, they should be advised as to the likelihood of their condition and presume themselves as positive. In high-risk situations, an antigen test will be given to those who need it. Additionally, the letter to Mercy Physicians states, we are currently out of monoclonal antibody infusions. These medications are distributed to health systems from the state, and as of today, we do not have any available at our facilities. Covering news where you live, Ian Taylor, 5 News.